there guys and gals, welcome back to Back Pocket Game Reviews. And today, we're going to talk a little bit about some, well, unfortunate and disgusting things that happened on Twitch the other day. Now keep in mind, this isn't anything to blame Twitch for, these are the actions of one individual, and they're, it's just like when people get mad at YouTube going, oh, how could you allow this content on your site? Unfortunately, there's just sometimes too much stuff to filter on your own. That's why all of these sites offer a flagging tool for you to be able to flag, hey, there's some bad shit going on here. Now, the other day on Twitch, unfortunately, a Twitch streamer by the name of Mr. Dead Moth. Yeah, it's kind of a stupid name. Uh, apparently, this is not the first time he's had an issue on a stream, which we'll get to, but Apparently his wife wanted him to come sit down for dinner, and he was in the middle of streaming. Obviously, priorities are very important, especially as an adult, and especially as someone with, you know, kids, and you're supposed to be the provider and purveyor of safety and financial stability to your family. At least that's what I envision the role of being a father as, and I mean, I could be wrong, maybe I see this incorrectly, but... A lot of times you have to prioritize. Typically, my streams are usually when everyone else in my household is going to bed. I know that sucks. I could get a lot more views during the day if I simply just stream during the day or even made a stream schedule. But I'm a parent and I work full time. So YouTube isn't my main job. YouTube is a side thing. So YouTube gets prioritized after those other things. Now, with that being said, this particular individual got relatively irate when his wife started nagging him to come to dinner. And I'm not saying she didn't nag him. She, she did nag him. Um, but, but, he also decided to viciously and savagely attack her, which is uh, pretty disgusting. Uh, especially did I mention that she's pregnant? Took a sick turn just now, didn't it? So, pregnant with his child, he decides to whoop her ass. Because she wants him to come sit down for dinner and stop playing games. It's almost like, instead of having, like, a partner, she has another child. Now, with this in mind, keep in mind a lot of people are digging into this guy, trying to find out more about him at this point. He is now in police custody. Um, and she was actually in police custody too, because apparently she hit him with a piece of cardboard. Piece of cardboard. And, uh, she's released. Charges against her were dropped. Charges against him stand. Uh, so, what have people been finding out about him? Well, it is also detailed out that he has Asperger's. That is not an excuse, um, but it could explain why he has so much issue processing or handling those responsibilities and possibly taking that on. I'm not saying everyone with Asperger's has that particular issue. Um, there are plenty of people that know how to overcome their disability. There are people that have all kinds of disabilities and you can't lump them together. Um, it, it would be literally if you're like, oh, well, Nick really likes orange juice because he's cracker ass white bread. I, I don't actually really like orange juice, which is kind of why I picked orange juice. I don't I don't really know if white people are supposed to love orange juice, but it was just it was just the blanket claim that I decided to go with. But it would literally be just like that if you're like, oh, well, all people with Asperger's or women beaters, it, it you can't really say it that way. Um, but. That, that's really not the only thing people that were digging found out. Apparently on a prior stream, he called his little girl, which we'll get to in a second because I'm going to readdress that statement in a moment. He told his little, he called her the C word. Now keep in mind, he is in Australia, so the C word isn't really like what it is here. And I get it, it's really hard as like an American looking on the other side. Um, Again, one of the channels I watch a lot of, I, I like bearing a lot. Uh, Australians and 
people in Britain tend to use the C word a lot. It's really just here in America that that word is like terrible. Um, and that's because of the power that we give the word. But, but, um, I still don't really think you should dress a child like that. And then also while they were digging, they found out that the other two kids aren't his. Uh, so keep in mind, this guy doesn't really disclose too much of his, like, personal life. Uh, it's, it's not like where I'm, like, super transparent with you guys. If I had a wet fart earlier this morning, you guys probably would have known about it. I overshare. I'm sorry. Um, but... That, that also kind of leads to the final problem while people were digging and what they found out. Apparently, and I cannot confirm that this is true, but there are a lot of sources saying this at this point. Um, apparently, he was arrested two years ago for child pornography. Yeah, I don't know if I had children, if I would allow my children to be around someone like that. And it, th there's so many multifaceted problems here. Because there's a lot of people like, oh, well, she hit him first with that piece of cardboard. It was completely all right for her to get the shit beat out of her. No. Look, I can tell you this. If some chick does come up to whoop your ass, and you do strike her back, I mean, if we're talking like, you just got your ass kicked, sure, go for it. Ronda Rousey decided to come up and sucker punch you, I would think you're an idiot if you didn't fight back. You're still probably gonna lose, but at least you went down with a fight. In this particular instance, this is a pregnant woman who, I mean, the slightest problem escalation-wise could cause issues for not just her life, but the other life. Um, it's pretty bad. Like, that's that's really low and disgusting. Uh, I'm, all, I'm all for equal rights. I personally couldn't hit a girl unless I knew I was probably going to get my ass kicked either way. So, yeah, if Ronda Rousey ever sucker punched me, I will hit her back. Not with the intention of winning, just with the intention of being like, she really whooped my ass, but I got a really good right hook on her. Now, if my wife were to come up and decide to punch me in the face, your difference here is, is I would probably try to de-escalate the situation. Um, my, my wife's not a fighter. She doesn't have the intention of, oh, I'm going to whoop some ass today. Um, as a guy, I have a lot more muscle than my wife. She wouldn't argue that. I wouldn't argue that. Um, and that's, it's not me boasting, it's not me trying to say the old men are better at this. It's just, we each fall into our gender roles, specifically. Uh, my wife doesn't do lifting. Uh, I lift a lot of stuff at work. Uh, there, there's just a difference in the way the muscles work there. But, there's no justifiable reason for how or why this happened. Like, it... This, this wasn't, oh, Ronda Rousey's the one who slapped him in the face. This is pregnant girlfriend slapped him in the face. I, girlfriend, wife, I really don't know which one they are. Um, but since then, obviously, he was getting a lot of backlash on Twitter. And his Twitter account is gone, most likely pulled by Twitter, not by him. Seeing as that, you know, he got arrested. So there's a lot of people going, oh, the coward deleted his Twitter account. No, most, most likely Twitter deleted his Twitter account. I'm not disagreeing that he is a coward. And he probably would have deleted his Twitter account, but usually it's pretty hard to access your Twitter from jail. Now, with that being said, with his past and with the other things back there, I really hope that this woman does the smart move and gets away from him. Because, I, I mean, if, if you saw the videos, I'm not going to post or link the videos. They are, not everyone's going to want to see them. And, uh, I mean, nothing happens in the screen. But you, you can hear it very, very well. Um, and both kids are there to watch that. Uh, so essentially, both kids just got to see... New daddy slapped mommy around. Yeah, um... Completely disgusting. Like, there, there really isn't much of an excuse here. And 
I really think with his prior record, I, I would really hope he doesn't see the outside of a jail cell again. Because not only are you a woman beater, but you also like small children. Yeah. I don't think he should have kids in his household. Personally, that's like a personal thing. I don't think that should be allowed. That should be a nope fish. Um, guys, I don't, I don't know what really else to say here about this situation. Um, covered really all the points that there are to cover, and I'm pretty much through talking about it. If you guys have questions, you can leave them down in the comments down below. If you have anything to add to this conversation, you can, again, leave those in the comments down below. If you want to follow me anywhere else, description box as always, thumbs up, subscribe, see you all soon, plenty more content.